Laborare est orare, to labor is to pray. This stands true for any type of work, be it manual or otherwise. Then why is physical labor considered to be less respectable than mental labor? Why would some youth of our country choose to be unemployed rather than take to humble, yet invaluable pursuits such as farming or carpentry? This is the result of the man-made distinction between one type of work and another. First world countries recognize the dignity of labor. In fact, they value manual labor and pay more for high-risk and physically demanding jobs. The undermining of such work would be a sign of a backward nation. All work is respectable and dignified and should be valued and appreciated. It is not the kind of job you do that is important, but how much you value your job and how well you do it. False notions of such prestigious and non-prestigious jobs are not only foolish, but harmful as well. These notions and aversion to manual labor have helped bring about the large-scale unemployment of educated youth in this country. It's time we recognize that all work is sacred and all that is done for the good of humanity should be celebrated. It's also time we taught our children to appreciate all kinds of employment and realize the worth of a hard worker. Because if you really think about it, the labor in the paddy fields and tea plantations, the sweat of the miners and the sleepless nights of the fishermen contribute to livelihoods that are as noble as that of any corporate worker.